So for that we may, we need to understand what is minimal. So minimal means if you can't remove anything from this particular set without compromising the underlying property. And underlying property is to cover all the all the vertices of the graph. So let me try to remove i. So if I remove i, then I won't be able to sell, uh, cover c. So therefore I can't remove i from this set. Let me try to remove g. So if I remove g, then I won't be able to cover d. So I can't remove g. Similarly, if I if I remove f, then I won't be able to cover d. So therefore, g i f this particular set is nothing but minimal edge cover because it's it is not possible to shrink this right without compromising the underlying property. Uh, so let me try one more. So I am starting with h. So using h, I can cover b and c. Now I am selecting i, so using i I can cover a and using now I am selecting f, so using f I will be able to cover d. So using h, i and f uh, I, I am able to cover all the vertices of the graph. So this is and this is a valid edge cover. Now the next question is whether this particular edge cover is minimal or not, right? So the answer is, think about it. So the answer is no, because we can remove i from this and after removal of i the new set is h comma f and using h and f you are still able to cover all the four vertices as you can see using h you can cover b and c and using f you can cover a and d 